Hey, welcome back to the channel. It's finally time for an apartment tour. I got all my furniture in. I'm still waiting for a few things like a poster, but besides that, I got everything. So let's begin. All right, so this is the door area. Just got, you know, my shoes, vacuum, an extra floor mat. Here's the bathroom. Don't bother, don't have to bother showing you guys that. But this is the view you see when you first walk in. And then got my coat rack, mask and stuff, and just stuff I've been using. Got to take those boxes out. Come over here, you got the kitchen. Got a nice fridge, dishwasher. Uh, nice dishwasher. Got an ice maker in there, I don't really use it. In the, the fridge, not the dishwasher, that'd be weird. Sink, no garbage disposal, but that's fine. Stove, oven, big microwave that takes up the whole counter. Uh, tons of cabinet space. Like, I can't even reach the top shelf to put stuff up there, so I kind of just threw some boxes up there that I don't need. Uh, didn't come with this. I actually bought this, it just sticks on. Um, yeah. And we got the light switches. There's a light switch way down there for that hallway one here for the kitchen and then I installed this one it came with a normal light switch like this this is a smart light switch so I can do things like computer turn off main light computer turn on main light mostly so I can turn the main light on and off from my bed because my bed's on the opposite side of the room so we got the closet Decent size, very skinny, but also very deep closet. So that's not bad, that's pretty nice. Little uh, cart thing that has some junk in those two, like cubes, and then all my game stuff, some extra computer parts, because I love building computers, and just accessories. Got my camera bag, and here we are. Got a nice futon. Got it from uh, Bed Bath. I'll try and have everything, up, every piece of furniture linked down below. Cubs flag, fly the W. Uh, nice coffee table. Got the AC unit over here. Got my desk, which is the cleanest desk setup I've ever had. I mean, if I sit down on the futon, you can barely see cables except for the power cables. And then my Wi-Fi stuff, which I'm still organizing a bit. You know, I got my computer. Specs are always in the description for this computer. No, not you. Uh, Xbox, PlayStation, both on vertical stands. Microphone on a rotating boom arm. Wall-mounted TV, wall-mounted soundbar. Actually, the soundbar is mounted to the bottom of the TV, which makes it great for moving the TV in and out because it is a full motion. So I want to stand in the kitchen, go watch TV. If I'm in bed, need to rotate a little bit, you can do that. Got these like cheap, I believe they're 3D printed uh, wall hangers for headphones. So I put my two headphones up there and then I had put them up, not completely centered. So I just threw a command strip up there that has the cable for the audio tech guys. Got my speakers, Go XLR keyboard over here we got my record player which connected to the go xlr so i can control the volume router that i actually don't really use i'm using more as a switch and a router for the uh, echo over there and then i had at t come in and install fiber i'm the first person and only person in this building right now to have fiber so i've got full gigabit fiber that uh, it's a blessing because the building came with internet, but the only issue is because so many people are using it, the uh, bandwidth is not great. Like it's the same speeds I have at home, but I can't watch a 4K video here on my phone, but at home I have no issue, so. Got a fan, big fan actually. I thought I was buying the same one I have at home, turns out this is bigger and I'm okay with that. Uh, dresser from Walmart, this side table, actually came with the coffee table from Amazon. The desk is from Amazon. It's got my stuff up here. I got my, my drawers. 
my records are tucked in the corner, backpack, whatever. This is my view of Grant Park. People, <gasps> dog. Look at that dog, cute dog. Grant Park, part of the city skyline. Uh, from certain points of view, you can see, you can kind of see it there. Right there, that is Lake Michigan. I am on Michigan Ave, which is great. Uh, we installed these blackout curtains because the curtains that came installed don't let a lot of, or let too much light in. And it's not fun waking up at 6.30 in the morning because I face east and that's when the, where the sun rises. Then we got my bed. It's a full size bed on a just metal bed frame from Walmart. But uh, yeah, it's a nice little space. It's about 355 square feet, I believe. Uh, I mostly keep the lights off when I'm not really using them. I mean, during the day, I get sufficient light from the window. I mostly keep the lights off uh, when I'm, even when I'm in here, just because I'm paying electricity now. I didn't at my last place or the dorm before that. So I pay electricity, uh, heating, cooling, which is included in electricity and internet now. But besides that, for the price I'm paying, which I'm not gonna disclose, you can try and figure that out all you want. Uh, it's actually a really good price for this area. The building, the apartments themselves are two years old. Uh, this actually used to be owned by my school for a few or for about seven years. They bought it in 2010. We're gonna move the school library here, decided not to. We're then going to build the student center here, decided not to, which I'm glad they didn't. They ended up building a $55 million student center. Ooh. But uh, they sold it in 2018. The new company bought it, turned them into apartments. Used to be an office building. Uh, it's considered Chicago landmark, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, took a while to get my futon, so that's why this video is probably about two and a half weeks after the move-in vlog was posted, because it took about two weeks from moving in to actually get it. I actually don't remember when I posted that move-in vlog. But yeah. This is my place. Uh, so far it's been great, it's been really nice. Uh, for a while, not having that futon was a pain because I had the TV, I had my desk. I didn't have a desk chair yet. And I didn't want to build the coffee table until I built the futon and my bed frame. So for a while, I was just sleeping on a mattress on the floor, which there's no issue with that. And then to eat, I was eating on the floor. But now I actually have a place to eat and I had ordered a table from Ikea that was supposed to like mount to the wall and fold down. Didn't arrive in time, so I just canceled the order because I didn't feel like waiting two months to get something, but it's nice. This is my little place. I got all my, my remotes. I didn't show you guys this, but all my remotes are under the coffee table. It's very convenient. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna end up putting up poster in the hallway. I don't know if you guys paid attention. That wall's pretty bare, but I ordered a picture of Wrigley. This picture. I took that picture on my phone, believe it or not, but uh, I'm going to post or going to get a poster to put up there. Uh, it should be on its way soon, but yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry, this video is one really short. Two, took a while to actually come out from based off of move-in. I know I said I was gonna try and film it the weekend after moving. That just didn't happen. Uh, I got caught up in doing stuff. I'd wake up, be like, I'm, I'm gonna record the video today and then start doing other stuff. And then I was like, okay, it's dark out. And I wanna record with some lighting in here besides the unit lighting. But yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys subscribe, stick around for a bit. Um, my goal is to vlog at least once a month. I don't know if that's gonna happen or not. I know I didn't end up posting a vlog in August and I wish I did. I just, I had nothing interesting going on. I was just getting ready for moving, so. But now that I'm in Chicago, even though, you know, COVID is still a thing, uh, hopefully I'll be able to vlog more, be able to go out, do some things, you know, socially distance and safe. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. and. See you guys next time.